Hello and welcome back to episode 2 of Fallout 4 Survival playthrough. Uh, kinda messed up a pretty, pretty good amount recording the second and third episode of this playthrough. Because I'm recording a, just a large session and cutting it into chunks right now. And I forgot to unmute my mic after doing something. So the audio or the commentary you're hearing right now is obviously laid over the gameplay because there is no commentary over it. It's just game noise, which I thought might have been a little bit boring. So uh, right now I'm, I don't know what I'm doing right now in the house. I'm supposed to be dropping off some junk and in the last episode I said I was going to clear up the, all the houses. I did do that. I got the Grognag the Barbarian comic book, and I got a little bit of healing items, which is good. They'll prove useful later. Uh, right now, I'm just looting as I make my uh, make my way over to dog meat. And uh, yeah, not much to say about what's going on. I mean. I was planning on this part right here just being sped up and lay music over it or something. But, I don't know, I feel like I needed to explain what was going on since there's no normal audio. We we got to dog meat. That's good. Uh, hmm. Give me a second. Okay. Needed to clear my throat. But, uh, I'm choosing a perk right now. I'm getting Blitz. Blitz is a very good perk. Since I'm doing a melee build. And, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll get to use it a little bit. Here, demonstrating why it's so good. It increases the melee distance in VATS. Allowing you to basically teleport all over the place. It's pretty useful. Now, uh, here in this building, not right now, but here in a minute, when I go into, like, the front lobby area, see, I mess with the door a little bit, because I never messed with it before, so I close it, and I think I reopen it. But I'm gonna, when I start going into the main lobby, I turn around and start looking around. It's because I could have sworn at one point... There's a landmine in, I don't know if it was specifically that gas station, but there's a landmine in a gas station. Also at Starlight Drive-In or something like that is a movie place. But I thought there was a grenade or a landmine in this one. There is not, thankfully, because it would have probably killed me instantly. But I looked around for a second for it and then continued to loot the place and, uh, <sighs> oh, I'm a little tired. Okay. But after I get done looting... Well, actually, hold on. Before I get done looting, I read this computer. And, uh... Basically, the only thing it says on that computer is... How the people that owned this gas station, the Red Rocket gas station, how they were illegally dumping all their radioactive material in a very conveniently placed cave right below the gas station and then I go and I do clear out that place just to uh, look around get some gear and use blitz blitz I, I went through the whole place without taking any damage I believe I might have taken like one or two hits of damage which is actually a good bit when you're on survival, but I didn't get hit very much. But, uh, nope, we got the using bullets right now. See, I'm just gonna teleport over there. Whack, whack, and teleport back. Whack, whack. And that is the power of bullets. But, uh, here in a second, I'm probably just gonna turn on some tunes and, uh, let it play through until I, uh, See you guys over in uh, Concord.
<sighs> so, uh, most of the way through this battle here in the front of Concord, or it it's in Concord, it's in front of the Museum of Freedom, I believe is what it was called, and, uh, yeah, I almost died at one point. I did not, though, so that's that's very good. I'm actually surprised I didn't get shot in the back while trying to run away. But hey. And uh, I'm just gonna sneak up on this raider and uh, finish off the last one. Whop! And whop! And he's dead. Uh, I believe I go on and continue to loot bodies out front before I head on into the main building to uh, finish the quest, I guess. But uh, after I get done looting here, uh, not sure what I do, but the next episode will definitely be me clearing the inside of the Museum of Freedom and fighting the Death Claw. So I look forward to that. But uh, thanks for watching, and uh, keep it tactical. Thank <laughs> you.